Hey, what's up, everybody? How you doing? Um, we're going to be doing a new article today. Uh, this happened yesterday, and I want to go ahead and talk about this because college humor was a huge, huge part of uh, what I considered uh, cool on the Internet. For the longest time, uh, college humor was always pumping out a lot of really great uh, skits and videos and they had great guest stars and all that and it's really really sad uh, to see that they're falling on really really hard times uh, I know that they try to do the whole woke thing but it wasn't really that bad some of it was admittedly but I don't really care about that I want to focus on a lot of the really good stuff that is that these guys have done uh, because it's it's sad when a uh, bad things happen to cool people and uh, bad things happen to good websites because I, I don't want anything really to go down like it was it was terrible when the old man now dog got freaking shuttered and I, I didn't want that uh, even though it has like no relevant purpose on today's internet whatever today's internet is supposed to mean uh, you know it was still a great thing to have so Let's go ahead and just get into it. This is by Travis Helwig. College humor was full of insanely talented people who are not only super smart, but genuinely very kind. If you need anyone creative for any job, please hire these good people. And I have the uh, the, the article uh, open right here. We're going to go ahead and read that. Uh, so here's the article that the guy wrote. We're going to go ahead and just go through that. And uh, we'll have our little opinion at the end of it. Hmm? Almost everyone at College Humor lost their jobs today. This is by Meg Wright. And this is at 2.28 p.m. yesterday, January 8th, 2020. Layoffs have come for another online comedy outlet, one that has managed to survive on the Internet despite challenges for nearly 20 years. Multiple sources have confirmed to Vulture that College Humor was hit with a big round of layoffs today, which a rep for its parent company, IAC, has confirmed. About 100 employees in New York and Los Angeles have lost their jobs, with Bloomberg noting that around 5 to 10 people will remain at the company as it restructures under the supervision of CCO Sam Wright, who explains the news on Twitter. So bad news with a twist. IAC, our parent company, has made the difficult decision to no longer finance us. Today, 100-plus brilliant people lost their jobs, some of whom are dear, dear or my dear, dear friends. Hire them. The twist, however, is that IAC has agreed to let me run with the company myself. In words that I'm sure are as surreal to read as they are to type, I will soon become the new majority owner of CH Media. Of course, I can't keep it going like you're used to. While we were on the way to becoming profitable, we were nonetheless losing money, and I myself have no money to be able to lose. That means like no one's made, made a profit in years. If you look at their social blade analytics, there is a definite freaking peak and then a damn plummet. And it's, it's a real shame to see that, but hey, if you don't pump out quality content, you know, personally, even though I love the website to death, I can't seem to remember anything other than college humor uh, uh, basis look too bored with Mark Hoppus from Blink-182. Uh, that was seven years ago, and that was one of my favorite little skits. Unfortunately, I can't tell you the last time I laughed at anything college humor related. Is It's been a long time. I've seen a bunch, but a lot of it has been kind of cringy. Not to, not to crap all over them. I really like the company. I really like everyone. It's just that the humor has not been my, uh, my forte, I suppose. Anyway, back to the article. Long story short, I need your support now more than ever. The number one way you can support me is to stay subscribed to Dropout. We have six months worth of content still to release. Dimension 20, Um, Game Changer, Breaking News, and more. Dropout 2.0 launches at the end of the month, and along with it comes two long-desired features, A, downloads, and, T, and, uh, and B, international Discord access. In these six months, I hope to be able to save Dropout, College Humor, 
Dwarfy, Dorkly. Oh, not Dorkly. I love Dorkly. I didn't know Dorkly was involved. This is now an official layer of heartbreak added to this. Oh, man. They're going to suffer hard. And many of our shows. Some will need to take on bold new creative directions in order to survive. Th th they're going to get canned. Because what the fuck does bold creative direction? Like, what, what does that even mean? That doesn't mean anything. You know, just tell, you know, it personally, I would just say, please just tell me I'm freaking fired so I can just go home and look for another job. Don't tell me to go check out a, a bold new creative direction. Like, what does that even mean? Like, Dorkly, Dorkly has no other bold creative direction to go to. You know, it's, it's Dorkly. It's only really good for, like, one thing. If you change that one thing, it's just... It's not dorkly anymore. It's just... It's probably not... It, uh, no. I will, however, do my very best to stay true to the talent, show, fans, and principles that got us where we are today. We dropped out once before. We can do it again. Independent comedy lives on. Just now more independent, gulp, than ever before. Yeah, I don't see them making it to the end of this year. Not with... Uh, th this, this is written with an air of panic uh, <laughs> in, in this person's voice. College Humor, which also runs the streaming comedy service Dropout, has been owned by Barry Diller's IAC Interactive Core, Interactive Core since 2006. IAC also owns the video site Vimeo, several dating sites and apps like Match.com and Tinder, Oh, wow, really? And the news site, The Daily Beast. Really? The Daily Beast, Match.com, and Tinder, and they're still not being able to fund these people? Might be some financial problems in the parent company. Uh, if you can't make a freaking buck with Tinder, exclusively Tinder, you're probably screwing something up. IAC has been exploring, all po uh, exploring a possible sale of college humor in recent months. After Reich takes over, IAC will reportedly retain a minority stake in the company. Sam was the best choice to acquire CH Media and define its next chapter, a representative of IAC said in a statement. The decision places CH Media with an owner who is beloved by fans, passionate about the business, and sees a future we believe in. Unfortunately, layoffs and even complete shutdowns have been a trend for internet comedy outlets in recent years. Several rounds of layoffs took place at Funny or Die between 2016 and 2018. They haven't reproduced Jack Squat worth, uh, worth watching. I'm sorry. Funny or Die used to be really, really good. And then they sort of just dropped off the face of the planet. Uh, you know, And that's not like because of any personal politics or anything like that. I just think they're not that funny anymore. Let's see. Where were we? including the closing of a company's San, San Mateo engineering office and the New York office, as well as layoffs in its entire editorial team in early 2018, which preceded its partnership with Vox Media Platform, Vox Media, oh, excuse me, which preceded its partnership with, with Vox Media's platform later that year. NBC Universal streaming comedy service CISO suffered an even steeper decline shutting down in 2017 after less than two years because what does a comedy streaming service even supposed to look like you know i have youtube anyway turner's comedy site super deluxe shut down oh and, uh, and then the turner's comedy site super deluxe shut down in 2018 F to pay respects for Super Deluxe. They are always a great site. Professor Brothers, uh, 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 Babyface came from over there. Uh, China, Illinois came from over there. Uh, some really, really cool stuff came from uh, Super Deluxe, but they're gone, unfortunately. That is to say, it's tougher than ever to survive as an online comedy outlet these days, especially for original video. But College Humor has managed to stick around since 1999, which is an accomplishment on its own. Yeah, and it was a great, great website back then. You know, I remember the, the first three years of its life uh, having some of the best and funniest and edgiest content out there. Unfortunately, they didn't really get with the times, and they just didn't really, they didn't bring the funny uh, anymore. It used to be really good, unfortunately. 
Uh, I don't think that these people will be, uh, I don't think they're long for this world. And they're probably going to end up having to shutter their doors by the end of it. I just, unfortunately, as as much as I hate it to say, I hate to say it, I don't see college humor lasting in the long run. Uh, this isn't like Hello Games, where they hit, where they made No Man's Sky, and that was a huge, huge flop. And then they decided to uh, stick with the little menial, the the minimal staff that they had, and improve the game get some money under there and then hire a bunch more people to help out with the game I don't think that we're going to see a, a revisitation of that at all uh, unfortunately I it's a for it's it's a comedy website and comedy websites are fun but they're not long for this world we have YouTube for crying out loud and honestly it's just no one's really that funny anymore like I think individuals are funny but having eating a website to get your funny it's just you don't need it anymore. It's 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 a it's it's an old it's it's going the way of the dinosaur. It's 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 old hat. We don't really need it anymore. We have other places to go to. Anyway, if you like this content and you like what you see, go ahead and hit the subscription button and turn on notifications for when I go uh, upload another video. Until then, thanks for coming out. I really appreciate it. Thanks for watching the video. Until next time, ta ta.